A baby tiger in distress has flown from Ohio to Long Island for medical treatment. Her name is Simba, and her journey is all due to a Farmingdale resident known as the Tiger Man. Here's CBS 2's Scott Rappaport. Sweet and adorable as she looks, little Simba, a 12-week-old Siberian tiger from a zoo in Ohio, has been suffering from a disorder so severe that just a few days ago she was almost put to sleep. Simba was showing uh, a really profound loss of balance. The biggest worry was that if she had an infection in her brain or a tumor in her brain, there might have been nothing we could do to help the tiger. Today, inside this vet clinic in Farmingdale, Simba is receiving the crucial medical attention she needs, flown here from Ohio courtesy of a guy they call the Tiger Man. You pray that you can make the cat better, that the doctors you believe in will do the job. We first introduced you to Larry Wallach back in August, an eccentric of sorts who for 20 years has been taking in unwanted, abandoned, or sick lions and tigers and bears. Oh, my. And looking after them in his own special way. Very carefully. <laughs> and you have to have a good kosher butcher. Which brings us back to baby Simba here. <laughs> who needed a whole lot of help. Cat scans, CT scans, blood work, thousands of dollars of advanced medical care to diagnose the tiger's troubles. Money Larry's paying out of his own pocket. It's worth it. Look at it. It's worth it. Indeed, the prognosis for Simba is now good. Turns out her problem is not a tumor. In a rare infection. Thank God. Isn't that great? An inner ear infection, easily treated. Simba could be back home in Ohio by Christmas, thanks to the Tiger Man. Scott Rappaport, CBS 2 News. Larry Wallach is a former SPCA wildlife officer and a successful businessman, which allows him to indulge his passion for caring for needy apples. Animals. Animals.